Hello everybody. Welcome to Erndale's. And it is December 24th, the 24th day of Vlogmas. Wow. I did it. <laughs> so it's Christmas Eve and I'm just sitting here in the living room and um, just kind of reflecting on the whole 24 days of Vlogmas. I have to be perfectly honest with you, I never even considered doing Vlogmas until about two days before I started it. And I had no plans. I didn't know what I was going to talk about, what I was going to do. <clears throat> um, I just wanted, I, all I knew is that I wanted to do something different than the other Vlogmas out there. And I don't know if I succeeded or not, <clears throat> but I just wanted to give you something different every day, something from me to you. I wanted to share some of my <clears throat> gifts, some of my talents, some of the things that I treasure about Christmas, some of the things that I treasure about things that I have from my mom, my aunts from Christmas. Um, I wanted to share some music and some poetry. And so I hope that I had um, enough interest to keep you coming every day for 24 days. 23, because I did miss one day, didn't I? Yeah, I did. So um, today I'm going to read you the final poem <clears throat> called Christmas Eve. And this one actually was um, published in the 2011 Country Woman Christmas book. They had a contest, and I entered it, and I won. Um, it's much like the other poems that I have written. <clears throat> I think I wrote this just for this uh, contest, so it, it was written in 2011. And um, before I read it, I just want to kind of touch on <clears throat> Christmas and Christmas Eve. And I want Chip to be quiet, <laughs> which isn't, I'm not going to get what I want there, I don't think. Anyway, I really didn't know what I was going to do with Vlogmas until I did the, I think it was December the 4th, when I did the Vlogma on the banners that my mom had made. And I talked about, <clears throat> sorry, my voice is so raspy. I talked about the Advent candle and the meaning of the four candles. And whether you celebrate Christmas or you don't celebrate Christmas, I don't think it really matters. I think what really matters is actually those four candles. So the first one was joy for the first week, and the second one was hope, and the third was peace, and the fourth was love. And I think those are the four really important messages that I want to bring forth in my Vlogmas. We all need joy. We all need hope. We all need peace. And we all need love. And in my own way, that's what I was trying to share with you this Christmas season. So... I want to thank you very much for coming along with me and checking in with me every day. And I have really enjoyed your comments so very much. You have no idea how inspiring your comments to me were. And you said that I was inspiring you, but you were inspiring me just as much. So thank you so much for all your beautiful comments. I feel like I've made some new friends and that's a wonderful feeling. And just before I read my poem. I also want to say that I'm going to take a couple weeks off. I will start up my vlogs after the new year, in the new year, early in the new year, and I already have some new ideas of things that I want to make with you and show you that I'm making. I've got one particular thing in my mind. The other thing was I really wanted to do a vlogma on candle making, but not candle making in the new way. I wanted to do it in the 
old way. So that might be the very first vlog that I do in the new year. And that's all I'm going to say about that right now. So I'm going to read you Christmas Eve from 2011. Oh, and I need my glasses, don't I? Just hold on, I gotta put them on. There we go. Huh. Amazing how much more you can see when you put your glasses on. Christmas Eve. A frosty night, a home so warm, with loved ones gathered near. Christmas everywhere we look, and spirits full of cheer. <clears throat> Mom is baking one last time, the tree is trimmed and bright. Father tells us all the tale of Jesus born this night. <clears throat> it's love that makes us gather here, not presents from a store. Our family, both young and old, together one time more. Loving hearts, for all we see, will make this Christmas right. Just like that first one long ago on yet another night. I wish you all a very Merry Christmas or whatever you celebrate at this time of the year. But most of all, I wish you joy, hope, peace, and love. See you next year. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, everybody.